cycle. For the next few weeks, the water level is only gonna rise and we need to cross the river before it gets any higher. All right, oh During the winter months, a cattle herd calls this place home. In the spring, we gather them up and herd them to higher elevations. In the last video, when the water was low, we gathered the majority of the herd, but some of the calves were too small to keep up. So we left them and their mothers behind. Now it's time to find them. They could be hiding anywhere out here. And if we find them, there's a good chance they don't want to leave. <laughs> On top of all that, we have to cross the river. And they might not even be able to cross it. That's a lot of water. I hope I don't get wet, man. <laughs> we'll see how the new donkey likes to cross creeks. So we're just driving by this river here and it's looking pretty high. It's gonna be a good day, boys. <laughs> Red, light out. Hey. <laughs> He's a dog whisperer. Get in. Get in. Get in. Get in. Get in. Hey! Topaz. Topaz. Hey! Before we can start looking for the cattle, we need to get things ready to go. Since there are no corrals out here, this is the best place to load up any cows we might find. We're gonna use this barricade to load up the cows. We brought a few panels and we're gonna try, try to build a little makeshift corral here. So we'll see how that goes. Did you get your dogs loaded up, Wyatt? Oh yeah, every time. <laughs> dude, you see that high water down there? Oh yeah, dude, that <laughs> looks scary. <laughs> it's gonna be pretty interesting. I hope yeah. I don't get wet. <laughs> From this point on, there are no roads in the area, and the cattle could be hiding almost anywhere. All right, we left the old Swift at the trailhead in case we need to rope something. Before we start looking for them, we decide to check out the river. The dogs haven't seen this much water before, so they jump in not knowing how deep it is. <laughs> that dog don't know how to swim. That's why, Dally. <laughs> Holy crap. Come on, dog. She can't get over that bank. Come here, come on, come on, come on. There you go. If we have to cross the river at some point today, hopefully my horse can swim better than the dogs. The first place we decide to look for the cattle is in a long canyon. The tall canyon walls shade multiple freshwater springs, making this an ideal place for the cattle to hang out in. Yeah, doesn't look like there's any tracks. So, nothing up this canyon. We'll go look somewhere else. It's not looking like there's anything up this way. So that means we gotta go back to the main canyon, cross over the river and look someplace else. Should get a little interesting here. I think old Willie's gonna go for a swim. But as long as I stay on all four, I bet I'll stay the driest because I'm on the tallest. <laughs> I think I'm on the shortest horse today. <laughs> My feet are getting wet for sure. Crossing that stream might get a little interesting, boys. After making our way back to the river, we got a second look at it. And, well, it looked a bit more intimidating this time. So far, we haven't had to cross the river yet, and there's a chance we won't have to. It all depends on where we find the cows. We searched along the river for a few hours. We tried spotting them from up high, we looked for tracks, and we even spread out through the brush just in case they were hiding in it. But we had no luck finding them. At this point, we're ready to give up the search. Okay, if this is this deep, how deep is that? No kidding. Dozer! Dozer! 
Dude, there's a plane every time we come out here. Is he gonna land? This plane is most likely just checking us out, but there is a chance it's trying to tell us something. So, we decide to check one last place. And it paid off because we found them. There's just one problem. They're on the other side of the river. Those it goes. We found two groups of cattle and they're on opposite sides of the river. This group's on our side, so we'll worry about them later. For now, we need to find a place to cross. What are you thinking? Oh, he's over there crushing them. Sweet. Skeet him. Get him, Topaz. This looks deep, doesn't it? Where do you usually cross? Oh, he's down here. You like that? Right there, maybe? Okay. Right here, the river is shallow but that also means the rapids are stronger. Oh my gosh, dude. I'll just walk in a little bit, see what it feels like. Keep your rope out in case you need to rope me. Good. There's no fast. That gets you so dizzy. I can't believe how dizzy that gets you. I had to close my eyes. I was starting to go like, I thought I went really far out there and I turned around and I was only that far off. I was like, no way. It feels like we've been walking for miles. <laughs> it's important we find a safe way to cross the river because the cows will need to cross in the same place. Whatever you do, don't look at the water. <laughs> I'll try not to. Oh my gosh. I get deep right away. That's crazy. Dude, that was to your boots. <laughs> oh, I don't like this. No more test runs. It's time to see if I can make it to the other bank. Let's go, baby girl. Oh, what a pony. My boot's full of water right now. It actually feels good though. It's hot out here. Dude, that gets you dizzy. Like I've heard it before, but it's never happened that bad. It legit gets you really dizzy. Because it took us a few minutes to cross, the cattle got a big head start and they took off into the thick brush. <laughs> Those cows are right here. We can hear them in the trees. Should I just run through there on foot? Yeah, if you want. Okay, will you take my horse with you? Yeah. And I'll just walk through there. Wild stuff, boys. Hey cows, hey! Get him, get him, get him, get him. Hey! 
Hey, cows! Hey, cows! Hey! 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 Hey, cows! Hey, cows! Hey! Hey! <laughs> Them horn suckers are scary. <laughs> Hi. Now that we've got them together in the open, we're ready to cross. Oh, uh, not quite, I don't think. But they're going for it. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, hey. All right, oh shit. Some of the cows took off, but we stopped them before they could get very far. Hey! Hey! We almost got a few hey. of the cows to cross, so we'll try the same thing again. Hey cows, just go in the river. Let's try and put some cows right here, bro. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, 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 At this point, it's pretty clear that the cows won't cross without their calves. So, in the heat of the moment, I decide to help this calf cross the river. I tied it up where its mom can see it, so hopefully she'll lead the herd across the river. Our plan worked, but it might have worked a little too fast. You can see the mama cow crossing the river before we're ready with the rest of the herd. Hopefully she'll just hang out on the other side where the rest of the cows can see her. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, 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 hey. Swim! Swim! Our celebration was short-lived, because now we have to figure out a way to load these cows in the trailer. And they're pretty wild. <laughs> well boys, the Bronx and Donks rope saved the day. Drug the calf across. Check them out at bronxanddonks.com. After pushing the cows a few miles down the trail, we made it to the road. 
and we decided it was time for a lunch break. Good day to be alive. So <laughs> hungry. You could eat the south end of a north, northbound donkey. Go! <laughs> <laughs> We've got to head up the road, finish grilling these cows, but we don't have a grill, so we got to load these cows somehow. Thank you, Willie. The makeshift corral is a few miles up the road, so Willie's gonna drive ahead to make sure it's ready to go. I wonder if somebody's lost a phone. It's got like tape on it and stuff. Just find a phone? Yeah. yeah. Crazy. Hmm. How peculiar. Say peculiar. Peculiar. <laughs> that is the hardest word to say. Peculiar. 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 Peculia. Later that afternoon, we loaded the cattle up, and surprisingly, it went pretty smooth. Behind you, behind you. Whoa. Behind you, behind you. Whoa. It's funny to think that finding water in a desert is typically a good thing, but we spent most of our day avoiding it, and even though we got a little wet, this has been by far one of my favorite adventures. <laughs>